crypto slow, cryptocurrency news and investing. Crypto slow with more crypto gains. What's up, guys? So, quick video. Uh, if you're the owner of a BMW, you probably ended up on this video because of this little bugger right here. That stupid little camera. All right, so I'll give you a quick rundown of what happened. So I was driving, didn't even know it, went to the car wash, and what you know, this camera was cracked, okay? So here's the problem. The front of this car has tons of sensors, parking sensors, radar. This sensor right here, that's $4,000. That's an insurance claim if that sucker gets hit. But what I wanted to talk about specifically was this camera. Number one, if it gets cracked, your dealer may or may not replace this camera, number one. Number two, you can get knockoffs on eBay for about $100 to $150. This camera online, I will leave the part number down because a lot of dealerships are reluctant to give you the part number. Ranges from five to 700. Out the door, you're looking at 750 to 1100 dollars and initially they said they were taken off the bumper but from what i've read you can pop one of these kidneys out and you can stick your finger in here and you can feel that camera is just clipped in now the question is what can you do to protect this typically when people do a wrap or ppf on the front of the car um the sensors they'll do cutouts on these sensors because these sensors are very sensitive to mill thickness over them and they won't function properly. However, this camera is just a vision camera. So what have I done to try to alleviate this problem in the future? I've just, I ordered a, just a small batch of Expel PPF and I wrapped this over. You can see the line for the PPF and I still have some moisture in here but what I've been doing is this dries um, and I've run it across the camera because I think it's gonna give better rock protection. Um, it's not perfect, I'm no expert and I don't really care if there's a bubble or something in there. What I'm trying to avoid is a $1,100 fix in the future. So um, we'll see how it works out. We'll see if I have condensation problems. I really don't drive the car in the winter um, I'll probably store it here, you know, in the next couple of weeks anyways and get my truck out for the winter. Um, but, you know, putting a little PPF on there may hopefully give me some rock protection. Um, and it's unfortunate. Pretty much all the new BMWs, if you have the parking assist package, have this um, on there. Now, as far as going around the car, there's other cameras. It's the same camera that's used on here. Now, technically a rock could pop up and hit that. That'd be crazy expensive. There's another one of these cameras in the back, um, right there. So these cameras are all over. And I know on the new electric one, they're like even more cameras. So that's 700 a pop, you know. You want to protect it. Like I said, if I have condensation problems, I'll do a follow-up video. But as this PPF dries, I'm just trying to squeeze squeeze more bubbles out of it. But obviously, it's not sealed on the backside, so you're still probably going to get some airflow in there. But if I can get it flat enough across the glass, um, that's really all I'm worried about. Now, I could take a razor knife. I really don't feel comfortable doing that and cut around. At first I tried cutting a circle, it was about impossible. And I'm sure someone's gonna come up with a solution for protectors that are pre-cut. Um, I know the Tesla has a lot of them, but like I said, um, you could remove the grill and just put a knockoff in there or get an OEM if that's what you want. But at 1100 bucks, man, you wanna try to protect it if you can. So anyways, hope you like this video. Like, subscribe, as always. This is Crypto Slow. If you're not talking gains, then we're not talking.